anti a pink lightning bug. Quick little side note about lightning bugs. There's a thousand different variations of lightning bugs. Green, purple, pink, fuchsia. Um, a lot of people call lightning or fly a lightning bug just because it has a flash body. Um, this is just a variation that comes straight out of our fly boxes and we found the most productive version of a pink lightning bug for the Missouri River. We're going to tie it on a scud hook. Right now I'm using a Dairiki 135 size 16. We got a 330 seconds silver tungsten bead on it and that we will be using 8 aunt pink uni thread. We're going to start the thread right behind the bead. Okay, for our tail, we're going to use we're going to use fluorescent shell pink antron yarn. Okay, and we're not going to split <clears throat> this this strand of antron. We're going to use the whole piece that comes off off the board. We're going to tie it in, tension that thread, and then we're just going to pull straight down, anchor it down. Now we're just going to wrap that material in down into the shank, not too far, but you do want that tail pointing slightly down. Wrap back up to where we tied it in, trim our ends. Okay, for our rib, we're going to be using small silver wire, tying our silver wire right where we tied in that antron, and then just wrap down the body. We're going to stop wrapping where we stop wrapping for our tail. Move the thread back up again. All right, now for our body, we're going to use metallic pink flashaboo. We're going to cut off a couple strands. Tying that material right where we've tied in everything else. Pinch that thread, pull straight down. And then wrap back down. Move our thread back up. From those ends just a little bit. Now we're just going to start wrapping the body with our flashaboo. And you want to try and cover up all that thread. That's why we use a couple strands of flashaboo. Tie it off. Now we're going to wrap our silver wire up. I don't like to use real tight wraps. And essentially this silver wire is just giving giving the fly a little bit of segmentation and it's protecting that flash boo. That flash boo is pretty fragile stuff. Break our wire off. Okay, now for our thorax, we're gonna use UV pink ice dub. And you want the thorax to be a little, little shaggy, so you don't need to dub it really tight, but you don't want to dub it really loose. Ice dub has a tendency to kind of peel away as you fish it. So we're just going to wrap a quick little thorax. Now we're going to whip finish. Using a double five turn whip finish. Break our thread off. Now we're just going to trim the tail to length, and this length is relatively arbitrary. I don't like it real long, so we're going to kind of just clip it so we have a kind of a short, stubby little pink tail. And there you go, a completed size 16 pink lightning bug.